the first start up after that f storm, beast of the east, or whatever it was. Um, we had up to minus five, minus six. I haven't started it yet. Tried the handbrake in that whole time or anything, so uh, he's hoping. Battery seems all right. First time as per the usual. As per the usual. It's been five minutes and she's still running, just waiting for the uh, temperature gauge to go up. Let's see if it stays in the right place. How is it that no matter what I do, it's always messy, you know? It always needs tidying up. So just before the storm we went shopping and I got some more mason jars to go up there. Good little place for them. We got a new kettle, much bigger one. And it's three litres, so it beats the hell out of that one over there. Uh, I've no idea what this is. This is an egg light thing. No idea. Um, and some bamboo bowls because we're weird and I don't know why. I've got plenty of uh, disposable ones under there which we were using to make life easy. But I've no idea. So also, I have made these two little tubs down here, which is what I was talking about in the last video, and they just fit nice and snug in there. I can take them out easily, but the important thing is I can put a few bits in them. So she's been running for about 10 minutes now, temperature gauge is all good, she's running fine, she's running amazingly actually, considering it's got so much warmer. She loves being up to temperature, um, that's it for today, I've aired stuff out in the back, popped a load of stuff on the uh, table so that I know I've got to install it this week ready for our trip next weekend um, hopefully this week after work I'll get some stuff done um, like the mason jars fitted underneath the shelf another one of those nets up a net at the back door I do also need to sort out the security of the back door because you can't lock it from the inside it's a bit of a problem at the moment might have to skip that one and just deal with it when I go to Durdle Door um, I'll obviously give it a massive tidy up. Um, winter's pretty much over now, thank God. So I can probably get rid of them. Um, that's pretty much it, yeah. I just want to make sure that these work with my old stove as they are different cartridges. Believe it or not, they are identical boxes, but apparently by different makes. Portable gas range have the same logo on and everything. They have come from exactly the same factory. They've just got a different logo written on them. Hello. Does this one look a bit, a little bit better quality, maybe? testing this because when we bought our first one originally, got it from uh, Sainsbury's, it didn't actually work so we went away for the night without checking it and it was broken. Sweet. Lush. <coughs> Shelter pod has arrived. Well, it's definitely orange, but that is what we ordered. Not enough room in here.
I doubt this is ever going to go back in this bag the same ever again. But I'm not going to take it apart for now. I'm going to leave it. We're going away to Dirtle Door on Sunday, so we shall erect it for the first time then. It's all coming together, people. Excuse me. Crowded in there. Not so much a motorhome as a uh, comfy bed in a van rather than a tent. Whatever. <clears throat> I need to hoover this as well. I'm going to take it home today. <clears throat> and that is where that shall live.